All right, everybody. Hello, hello. As always, welcome back to Ultra Keller Real Estate. Uh, thank you for all support, all subscribers. Greatly appreciate it. So this is the number one rule, I would say, if you're buying an area where, like, you know, you're looking at because you're thinking that gentrification is about to happen. So people always ask this question, like, you know, hey, I'm looking at this area. Like, you know, they just put a brand new store here. I think, like, you know, the area is going to start getting gentrified. Like, you know, you think it'd be a good idea to buy here. So in my opinion, this is the number one rule to think about if you're buying an area anticipating gentrification. Make sure that if the gentrification does not happen, it's an area that you will still want to own property in if it does not happen. All right, does that make sense? So let's say you look in the XYZ neighborhood or suburb, like you know, in your city, and you say, hey, you know, this area is close to downtown, close to a university, this, that, and the third. I think this area is going to gentrify. I think I could buy this property right now for a hundred thousand dollars and maybe in five years it'll be worth two fifty three hundred thousand dollars because the whole area is about to change if that happens and you buy the property and it increases in equity like that that's great but and this is a big but make sure that if the gentrification does not happen that you still want to own a property in that area you know my dad would always tell me you know don't become a don't wanter and trust me, in my short time, or I guess my, my 12 years in real estate, I've seen that happen. I've met people who are what my dad would call don't wanters. They bought a property and for whatever happened, X, Y, Z happened, this happened in the third. And now they outright just don't want the property. They want to figure out some way to get rid of it. So that's the number one thing to remember. If you're buying a property in the area because you're anticipating gentrification to happen, just make sure that if what you're thinking will happen does not happen, that you still want to own a property in that area. OK. All right. So got more videos coming soon. As always, thank you very much for rocking with me. If you're watching on YouTube, you can follow me on Instagram at Ultra Kellen. And if you're watching on YouTube, you can follow me on Instagram at Ultra Kellen. All right, guys. Till next time.